Hi y'all, uh, good morning. Today is the 14th. Today's Friday. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Of course, I work on Saturday. Um, but yeah, but that's not the reason why I'm coming to you. So, of course, I'm getting ready to go to work. But I wanted to say this, like, my mood has, it's not bad, but I was doing so good, y'all. So good. Um, so this felt like a, a setback for me uh, with my mood, you know. Um, but hopefully we'll get back on track. You know, sometimes I feel like sometimes when you're off of work too long, um, you know, you don't want to go back. Um, I just, I'm at the point right now that I just don't want to talk to customers. Um, and I was doing so good, y'all. Oh my goodness. This whole car accident thing and everything I have to go through, it's just setting me back. But, um, let me fill you in. So they try, uh, they called me yesterday, not about the car, I actually bring my car in Monday, um, to, you know, get it looked at and for them to give the insurance company a quote of how much it will be to fix it. So that's Monday. I have decided to keep Monday and Tuesday as my vacation days because I have that on Monday in the morning and I just don't want to be bothered so i'll have sunday through friday off well sunday through thursday off which will be well needed <laughs> um so i can get back on track get back to the gym all of this good stuff um like i'm so emotional y'all but it is what it is so the um what is it the medical side called me about my you know pain and suffering um so this is what they gave this is what they wanted to offer so they uh wanted to offer 1500 for pain and suffering a thousand dollars for wage loss lo loss of wages but because i missed four days i told them i didn't miss four days i was friday saturday monday tuesday and then they uh, was offering 7500 for medical bills. Um, so I was like, um, what if I don't use it all? Or what if it goes over, you know? She was like, well, if it goes under, you don't get paid out the difference. But she said, if it goes over the 7500 then you'll be out of pocket. So you guys, um... She was like, you don't have to make a decision just yet. I will be sending this to you. You can sign off on it if you like the offer. Now, for me, throughout this whole process, y'all, I'm not trying to do anything off of my emotions, right? Because in my head, I'm like, ooh, 2500 And then whatever money I get for the car, you know, that's my train of thought, right? Whether I keep the car or whether I let them do it as a total loss, who knows? I don't know. But anyways, I'm like, I don't want to act off any type of emotion. In my head, after I got off the call, I'm just like, Candace, you're going to be missing more days throughout the week for uh, physical therapy. They need to do that as well, right? So there's going to be additional days. How many days, how long I'll be in physical therapy for, I don't know. They haven't even called me just yet to set up my first appointment. I don't have to make a decision just yet. But these are the things that's going through my head. I'm like, yeah, we're not going to make any decision just yet, Candace, because you don't know what's going on in the future, right? Um, so, yeah. I'm not signing off on anything. Even for my pain and suffering, y'all, this has messed up my mood. <laughs> messed up my mood. Plus... You guys know I have to work, what, 110 hours to, no, I think 100 hours for the month to get my maximum bonus. So this is messing up my bonus as well, you know. I think, let me see, let me see. Because, you know, the month is not over. So, so far I have one, two, three, three. Wow, one, two, three, four, five, six, nope, oh wait, one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. At the end of this month, I'll be at eleven days or a hundred and eleven hours. Plus, you figure I did do that five hours of overtime, so I guess I'll be okay with getting my full bonus uh, for the month for the month of June. But it's just like it has made my mood not the best, you know. Um, so I will probably I will ask for more there. And the dogs were in the car with me, you know. Um, as I mentioned, Luna did get. She didn't get thrown to the floor. She slid down because I tried to hold them back. I don't know how good of a job I did. But still, Luna flew through the floor. Um, not flew, but fell to the floor. Her bed went with her. Um, you know, like, I don't know if you guys know I have, like, these uh, calming beds in the car for them. Because Luna used to get really car sick. And that helped a lot. So, yeah, I'm going to ask for more between, you know, my mood um, and probably having a book like a therapy session so I can, you know, just speak with somebody. So, no, I'm going to ask for more uh, for that. Uh, but I just wanted to feel you guys and I'm not acting on my emotions. Yeah, seeing money, dollar signs is always good, but I have to think in the long run, you know. The long run is... You guys are really messing with my money. <laughs> like, loss of wages, that's got to be more. Um, so, yeah, even though hopefully I plan on booking all of my um, things on days that I'm off. But, no, we're going to ask for more for both things. Um, I'm not going to call them just yet. I'll probably wait like a week. Um, I don't want to make any rash decisions. I just want to be in the right mental space before anything uh, so anyways i was like um about the medical bills you know um i said well what if it goes over she's i can go up to ten thousand i'm like yeah let's do ten thousand um i will say this so far from the urgent care even with the x-ray that bill was two hundred and two dollars and fifty cents my actual regular insurance paid like over $200 towards that bill. So that was cool. Even though it's not coming out of pocket for me, they will be the ones paying it. Um, but that's nice to know. That's all that bill was. Uh, $202.50. So I'll be uploading that. Um, obviously, the next bill I will have is um, my regular doctor's bill that's gonna probably be around 70 something dollars or a hundred dollars because he did fill out a form i don't know if they at this the place that i go to they changed over companies so their billing and pricing may have changed um if they if i have to like pay for forms to be filled out um so yeah there's gonna be that doctor visit and then you figure physical therapy as well for my neck arm situation. Um, I'm still having discomfort here, like the it's tense here, certain things. And even when I pick up things, it's no longer in my wrist. It's right here, like in my fork, like on top of my arm type of situation. So, yeah, and uh, I don't, you know, I've never been to physical therapy, but my doctor's like, yeah, it's going to be more pain before it gets better when you go to physical therapy because obviously they're working on stuff. So, yeah, y'all. Um, I just wanted to update y'all and just let you know this is what they, the first offer that they've given me. I'm not going to accept it. I'm going to definitely ask for more, but how much more, I don't know. And I'll keep you guys in the loop. Monday, I go for the car. Uh, so that's going to be another day off because even though it's vacation time for me, it is still a working day. Um, so I'm going to ask for that too. You know, these days are adding up. You guys got me doing these things and yeah, so <sighs> and so yeah, Monday, sometime next week, I'll keep you guys posted. I have to see if my job <laughs> accepts the form and how my doctor filled it out he was like yeah she was off of work from the 6th through the 12th 
and then he put on there she'll need a couple days off per month for physical therapy for like one to two months that's what he put down or one two to four sessions i forgot what he put down but yeah i'll keep you guys in the loop talk to you guys soon bye